Hello and welcome to the first episode of the Real Madrid career mode wherein we attempt to re- build Real Madrid by selling the old guard and bringing in the new guard so to speak. Uh, the old guard has won everything. The the new guard will be will have more motivation to win more trophies at the greatest club in the world, Hala Madrid in Adamas. So to speak, we have sold everything we could have sold, brought in new players, young players, players with high potential. So hopefully, as you can see the squad, I mean, should I keep Carvajal or should I sell Carvajal? I am thinking that maybe I should keep him and if I get an offer, say around 70 milli for him i'll be selling him of course if he's it is from barcelona i'll not be selling carvajal i don't wanna strengthen their squad yeah you can see i have kept valverde since and casemiro he has no replacement casemiro so i have added this takahiro nakai pp real madrid's newest sensation to the squad he was not in the database i have added hopefully that's all right with you mm, and my overall i am i mean sure he's good but he's 23 and she lacks that high potential if i sell if i can sell my overall i will maybe bringing bring back kubo from loan and sign the, those some talented Brazilian strikers, maybe Caio Jorge, the next Ronaldo, the, the Brazilian Ronaldo, maybe. So as you can see, we are seeing those potential of the players. Uh, this episode will be a bit lengthy. It will go seeing the players and what to do, what not to do. Uh, we have called back Kubo from loan. We will be offering him a new contract maybe we'll sell Asensio and basically we are selling players Asensio and Mayoral see they are 23-24 and they lack this potential to reach that 99 I mean sure they are not reaching 99 but come on they are they have stayed in for 3-4 seasons Asensio unfortunate injury but it is what it is hopefully He'll go to another club. He can, if he can perform better, there maybe we'll call back him. But for now, we are selling them all to generate the funds for bringing Kylian Mbappe Latin, the youngest Galactico, the only players since Pele, the only teenager since Pele to have scored in a World Cup final. None. Uh, we are seeing some players. See, um, Bailey is there, Alario, Eden Jeko, Eden Ketia. I mean, sure, they are good, but come on, this is Real Madrid. We take only the best. Maybe, hopefully, this once the season progresses, thing is, some youth academy from other clubs are on a free transfer. Hopefully, if they have high value and high potential. Maybe we might sign them to increase the squad depth. Like we did with Kubo and Nakai. They both played for Barca. And since Barca could not keep them due to that fair play restriction. Ah, here we see we are struck between Adeyemi and Via. However, I mean sure Via is good American son of our legend but... Adeyemi is good plus he is from Salzburg. Salzburg did produce Haaland before now Dominic Sobozlai and now Dhaka is playing maybe we call back. Now this training drills I'll be showing you once or twice and I'll be trying to do the rest of them off screen. Here I am thinking the club value has a bit fallen since we are attempting a rebuild so 
I won't sign a contract ship now, maybe in two seasons when the club value has increased and then we'll sign since then at that time we'll get a not a bit a much more amount of money and hopefully Caio Jorge the people the Brazilians are calling the next O Phenomeno the Santos guy maybe the next Pele only time will tell if he has a high value see at the rating of 53 only he has 8 million so it it is seen that it can be understood that he definitely has high potential plus he is only 18 or 17. Let's progress with the season. Oh sorry I had a call, spam call. Hopefully full on Mendy he is injured for the first match yeah but Adiemi it is fine it is fine. Adiemi has a higher bid that is why we are rebidding for Adiemi we need I think he'll perform good for Real Madrid and with the fact that Adiemi comes from Salzburg maybe if Jovic does not perform that well maybe we'll sell him and bring in January Aling Braut Haaland since in this game to buy a player the player must have played at least a season for the another for another club Haaland joined Dortmund in the middle of last season so Reynard yeah we did call him back from loan since we sold Borja Mayoral yeah now you can see we brought and then we give him will give him a new will bid a new deal for him 7.4 milli Caio Jorge he wants let's give him the contract he wants uh, yeah sure his demands are not outrageous I mean for the next player Brazilians can consider as the Pele Ronaldo his demands I say are fairly good quite good I mean Sure, the wages are a bit high, but uh, we are Real Madrid, we have a lot of money. If we don't have money, we make money. Let's give everyone new squad numbers. I'm thinking of giving Vinicius the number 7 since he does play on the left wing and he was brought in after Ronaldo was sold and before Hazard was brought in. Uh, this episode will go on like this we'll be seeing new players possibly buying them a very less match or very less sims in this game in this episode from the next episode we'll be trying to extend <coughs> maybe i'll complete the season in five or six episodes and i'll do try to give two or three episodes a week because i do have other commitments <coughs> You see everyone has got a new squad number if you do have problems with a certain player do let me know uh, yes hopefully you have seen all the squad numbers I'll be ending the month of August probably in this video and then And then from the next video I'll be starting the month of September that is the month from which the matches start at full fledged and the transfer window closes on 31st of August so George uh, you see the first friendly this is our we are going with this lineup
ना दिस इज़ नॉट द फ्रेंडली दिस इज़ द ला लीगा सॉरी फर्स्ट मैच अगस्ट दे पोर्ती वो आलावेस लेट्स सी होपफुली मे बी वी विन सिंस द स्क्वाड इज न्यू द प्लेयर्स मे टेक अ बिट ऑफ टाइम टू जेल इन एंड दे माई ड्रॉ we are trying with our new to we are replacing our center backs and maybe we'll be bringing in a our in place of valverde we are still leading i need desperately need a second goal i am afraid i would uh the match ends 2-2 defense is leaking odegaard is has been declared as the man of the match courtois has so far not performed well this is since this is the first episode i'm going a bit day by day from the next episodes they will be a bit shorter I'll be going to the match and in case we buy or sell a player outside of the transfer window. Sorry for the interruption. My mother did come. She was unaware of the fact that I was recording my audio. Ah, it's okay. Fernandez is <coughs> another playing who is 29 or 30 and who I want to add to the transfer list if we don't get a bit for him it's fine if we get a bit of 11 or 12 milli for him I'll definitely be selling him cause let's be honest we have four talented defenders and maybe and our backup left back in place of marcelo is someone who is a bit more defensive minded asamoa he was back in the day a good player now he is without a club see this is the second match we have drawn not a good start to la liga so far hopefully the team is taking a bit of time to gel hopefully once we reach the middle of september the team starts to perform well so f- as far as we don't lose it's okay i will take draws since 38 matches per season it's a long game it's a long season kurtua is disappointed with his performance as he should be he should be disappointed he is he was judged the la liga's best goalkeeper last year but hopefully we'll give him the benefit of doubt he has to perform with a new defense into new stoppers what you call center backs this is the third match with sevilla andalusian clubs i'll admit this was a pretty tough match sevilla is a tough opposition plus we went away to andalusia i am happy with the draw a uh, win at andalusia is a bit tough not a bit uh, definitely tough odegaard is injured for the next 4 days we have two games Okay, so Verratti is proposed for perf- thinking of a move to Liverpool. No, I mean that team is already talented. Thiago, Jorginho, G- Hendo. Come on, Liverpool, don't do this, please. And they did already buy Varane from us. And this is our first win against Betis. We got a goal with uh, Rodrigo and Aouar. this is the last match of this season i'll be showing you hopefully next month we'll be progressing fast if you do like the video did like the video please do like share comment and subscribe